Hi friends, I am Dr. Swapna Chekuri from Hyderabad Women and Fertility Center. Welcome to my channel. So today we will be discussing the most important uh, part of pregnancy which is nothing but first trimester scan. So many individuals they usually ask is it mandatory to go for a scan in the first three months of pregnancy because in the previous days our elderly people they say the scans will be starting only after fifth month and the checkup will be starting only after third month of uh, pregnancy but it's not so nowadays in the recent scenario we are seeing so many cases of missed abortion or ectopic pregnancies so all these can be diagnosed in the first three months of pregnancy as well so today let us discuss about the importance of uh, scan in the first three months of pregnancy so basically in that scan we'll be knowing whether the pregnancy is viable or not whether the heartbeat has started or not so if the heartbeat has started we'll be seeing in the subsequent scans how about the growth second thing and most important is like uh, we want to rule out whether it's uh, in the uterus or is it in the tube or the ovary suppose if it is in the uterus it's a healthy pregnancy and by chance if it is in the tube or ovary it should be diagnosed as early as possible so that we can save the pregnancy as well and we can save the tube as well so sometimes in ectopic pregnancy what happens if it is diagnosed late so uh, the tube in the tubal pregnancy it will grow up to a certain stage and after that it will get ruptured so so many patients will land us with ruptured ectopic pregnancy so these things can be diagnosed pretty early in the scan as well so that's the importance of first trimester scan and the second thing is uh, we want to know whether it's a single pregnancy or is it a multiple pregnancy and even in multiple pregnancy we'll be seeing whether the both the you know both the fetuses are of same size or uh, is it uh, like you know one pregnancy is healthy the other sac is empty if the other sac is empty again in the subsequent scans we'll be seeing whether the sac is getting absorbed on its own or is the size increasing or is it developing another pregnancy in that so all these things can be diagnosed only in the first trimester scan and uh, and even in the first trimester scan we can diagnose uh, any subchorionic hemorrhages some people know they present to us with the pregnancy test positive and they'll be having spotting on and off so in those cases also when we do a first trimester scan in that scan we'll know whether is there any internal hemorrhage or uh, is there any evidence of subchorionic hemorrhages so in those cases also we usually give them maximum hormonal support and we'll, we will be seeing in the subsequent scans whether that hemorrhage is coming down or is the size of the hematoma increasing so all this information can be diagnosed only in the first trimester scan uh, so friends this is the importance of the scan and uh, sometimes what happens in multiple pregnancy usually one of the sac will be healthy the other sac might be an anembryonic gestation where there won't be any fetal parts and there won't be any heartbeat as well so in those cases also we'll be just following up in the subsequent scans whether uh, that sac is regressing on its own or not and uh, one more most important in the first trimester scan is like molar pregnancy so in a molar pregnancy what happens there will be an empty sac and inside the sac it's like you know full of uh, uh, water bubbles like thing it will be like uh, full of pearls like thing so those things that is like nothing but molar pregnancy it is not a healthy pregnancy so all these type of pregnancies like abnormal pregnancies or uh, abnormal location all these things can be diagnosed only in the first trimester scan so that's the importance of uh, you know getting a ultrasound in the first three months few people might require scan after 15 to 20 days just to, to see whether the heartbeat is stable and whether the pregnancy is growing because in some cases we have observed like around six to seven weeks the heartbeat would have appeared again by eight to ninth week the heartbeat suddenly stops so in those cases that uh, cases we call it as missed abortions so in those cases also we need to see whether the you know, pregnancy is healthy ongoing or uh, is there any problem with the growing pregnancy so all this information can be uh, diagnosed i mean we can get the information in the first trimester scan so friends if you like this video and if you feel it's informative please like my video and subscribe to my channel and you can share with your family and friend members thank you